Hey folks, Andy Phillips, Tap Photography. Um, so we do a good bit of extractions. Um, so replacing backgrounds. So we, when we do an extraction, we shoot on white vinyl. We don't light it. We don't use green screens or blue screens or any of that stuff. We shoot on white vinyl and don't light it. Um, so with that, we're always on the lookout for digital backgrounds. Um, a good thing to keep in mind, and we, we shoot a lot of uh, a lot of sports seniors. So each time we go to a school to shoot sports or to shoot a, a senior, especially if it's a school that we've not been to before or it's a school we've not been to in a while or it's a separate different season from when we've been to that school, we will be on the lookout for shooting a few good digital backgrounds while we're there. Um, we're already set up, we're already doing stuff. Hey, you know, just take one without anybody in front of you, right? So um, be on the lookout for wanting or for the, the opportunity to shoot your own digital backgrounds, stuff that you don't have to buy. And it will work out well for your images because it's already what you would be shooting. Um, I never, or well, let's say almost never, I almost never shoot a senior in a gym. Gym lighting's horrible. Um, so what I do is I shoot the gym without anybody in it, shoot a lot of the gym, a lot of different angles, um, a lot of different locations, making sure I get something that's going to work for me. And then whenever we're shooting a uh, senior with sports, especially basketball, maybe volleyball, um, then we'll shoot some on our white background and I'll add those into their own gym later. I mean, you know, if you're, if you're in high school sports, you're going to want some in your own environment, not just any gym. So shoot your own digital backgrounds. See ya.